Hi everyone, Sunita here from Sunita Makes Crochet Items. Well, March came and went. Pretty much went. It's almost gone. It's got like, what is it? It's 20 seconds, so maybe a week left. Honestly, I don't even know. I just can't wait for April and March to, or May, I'm sorry, to come along because then I'll be off work for a while. Uh, because I gotta use that PTO time. Anyway, <clears throat> excuse me. The only thing I accomplished in March was the Count My Blessing Shawl. Remember, I originally started with three, and then I found this sparkly yarn. <laughs> it's so sparkly. And it was only one ball, so I finished it. It technically is a shawl, I mean, you can see, um, but I ended it three rows short without the bobbles, so it still works as a shawl for me because I'm so, you know, but it works. I will probably wear it as a cowl, then a shawl. And then, so the yarn that I bought for, um, to originally make the common balancing shawl with was Melissa's yarn from Crochet in Agreement. I think with that yarn, I'm going to make up, um, a different, um, shawl or cowl or wrap with that because as I was working it up, and I already fogged it, so I can't even show you how it looks. Um, the colors kind of blended all in one, and it didn't really look right. So I'm going to make another wrap with it, but break it up with like a solid color in between each row so that you can see it better. And then as for spring yarn, I was like, I think at row 15, 16, I don't know, of this shawl. And there's 46 um, rows of the yarn. I mean, of the ro 46 rows of this. You guys, my brain is not working today. 46 rows of the pattern. So I was halfway. There, but I didn't like it. And after I finished this one, I was like, I'm one and done. I'm I'm over it. Not that I'm over with the pattern because the pattern is very well written. And I just got over the counting. I could because I couldn't enjoy a TV show or YouTube. Um while working on it because it does need your full concentration but it works so i end up fogging all of the pattern and i'm gonna end up making uh one of these count my blessings and i keep saying count my blessings bursts of kindness beanie with it because this is all I have left. Well, this is the part that I had um, frogged, and this was what was left. So it, I think it's enough to make a beanie um, with it. So this is the project. And then I went to go pick up my son today. Oh, here is the one I had started with, Daniel's yarn that I purchased from Angela, my precious yarn array. So, I mean, this one came out pretty nice too. I don't, I think I only got to row 10 on this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
11, little 11. So I didn't get very far with this one. Maybe I'll pick this up again sometime in the future, but not today. Or not this month at least, because I still have to work. Well, finish this. Just gonna put that to the side. And then I went to go pick up my son today. So I ended up putting off a pattern for a scarf. Well, this is, is a shawl. This is a free pattern from Lime Brand. And look at, she's so beautiful. Um, she is from Hawaii, but I follow her on Instagram. And um, so I'm gonna work on this. It's just a shell wrap thingy. And I'm using Lion Brand scarf, scarfy and what is it? I don't know how to say that word, but it's navy in this brown color. So I'm gonna do that. And it's got a 6.5 hook. And of course, I'm using the V hook. But for this Couch Chronicle, welcome to all my new subscribers and returning subscribers. I appreciate you for taking the time to visit me. Hi guys. So, I caught my blushing shawl. It's been nipped in the bud. Spring yarn has been frogged. And I'm going to make a burst of kindness with it instead. Because I'm over counting. So, what are you guys doing? <laughs> 